to infinity here this okay. a should tends to some constant value then it's said to be convergence like Con converging at one point right mm. you have a study in the lens also convergent and divergent right yeah. convergent means it's reaching to the one point mm. and divergent means after that it's going to the lens it's going diverging here like this okay mm. it's going to infinity mm. so second i can write divergent here infinite series summation of n is said to be divergent if limit of n tends to infinity this s of n hmm. that go to the infinity either positive negative or infinity or negative infinity okay getting here yes sir. so this is so another thing is i will do the so many problems based on the convergent and divergent let me just explain first definitions so this is convergent and divergent third one will be oscillation Okay, so here that limit of n tends to infinity. Hmm. S n you are finding here. S n. Yeah. If you now here n, if you n tends to infinity, it's giving the two values. Two here, yeah? hmm. more value. If you finding the result here, yeah, finding the here limit n tends to infinity s of n. If you are getting the two values, hmm. then it's going to be oscillation. So you are oscillating. Hmm. I think we'll see example also this one. Okay. Now another things you keep in mind here, the positive term series. Positive term series means the, all the terms should be positive. Hmm. Okay. And then infinite series, like summation of a of n is given here, is said to be positive term series if hmm. all the terms are positive. Okay. Hmm. Another is alternating because this one all what it will come in the questions, so that's why I am def defining hmm. it here. Okay. Alternating series. Hmm. So any infinite series is said to be alternating if hmm. it is sign is alternating. If the sign is alternating, like two, then minus four, uh -huh. plus six, minus eight, like so on, it's going. Sign here okay. alternating. Uh, okay. Plus minus plus minus and so on, it's going. So hmm. this is called as alternating series. Okay. Some I will mark the note here before going mm. to the notes. Okay. Now keep in mind a positive term series if you given positive term series mm. means all the terms are positive, right? Mm. Is always convergent or divergent. Okay. It mm. can't be oscillation. Okay. Okay, always convergent or divergent. Hmm. Alternating series, which is sign is alternate, right? Yeah. Is always convergent or oscillation. Hmm. Oscillatory, you can write it here. It can't be divergent here if you give an alternating series. Okay. So consider if any series is given which is divergent and oscillation. Hmm. Okay, divergent and oscillations. Series are also called non convergent series. Getting here? Yeah. This one keep in mind here. This one if you not understand also fine because we'll see the problem then we'll mm. come to the conclusion here what is going on. Okay. Now this three thing formula I keep in mind here before starting the problem here. Summation of n. Sum mm. of first n natural number is mm. n to n plus 1 by 2, right? Mm. Next sum of a square of n natural number. n natural means like 1 plus 2 plus 3 and so on n. Huh. n square means 1 square plus 2 square plus 3 square and so on is given up to the n square. Hmm. So this formula is n into n plus 1 to n plus 1 by 6. This one also we have already studied in the PUC, right? Yeah, I don't remember. Sir. This one keep in mind, okay? Huh. One, n cube means 1 cube plus 2 cube because this one 
it will come in the uh, means questions. So before that, you should know here. So n q is equal to this formula is n into n plus one by two, and that one whole square. Okay, like same over here. Hmm. Just that will be a square. Where right. this three formula will keep in mind. Okay. Hmm. Any doubt till here? No, sir. Uh, so basics you understood. Now we'll go to the. Huh. Now, so see here. Okay, this if any series is given here, mm. so by directly by looking, we cannot say whether it's converging or divergent because if n square is there, I can say that value is not increasing here, right? Mm. One by n is there, there I can say that this is diverging here. But mm. if long series here, it depends upon the n. Mm. So directly by looking, we cannot say whether it's going to the infinity. Yeah, some constant values. Mm. So we need some method to find it. That's why we having the subtle test here. Mm. The test. If you satisfy the condition which uh, corresponding the scientist is given the test here, mm. satisfy, then we can say that that particular Convert. convergent here divergent. Mm. Okay. So first is here. So uh, what is the bounded uh, uh, bounded above and bounded below? Bounded below also will come in the next topic. Okay. Bounded okay. above, bounded below will come. Theorem is there. We will discuss. Mm. <clears throat> And that definitions also they have uh, written in your textbook. Okay, when college teachers they have written monotonically increasing functions. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So monotonically increasing means a function like yeah, any series which is increasing. Okay, always increasing. Okay. Yeah, maybe constant, okay. but cannot be decreased. That is mean by monotonically increasing. Hmm. A decreasing means either can be decreased or constant. It can't be increased. Okay. And bounded is simple word only. Bounded means if any. If given the bound, like uh, consider, hmm. I put m is equal to 100, right? Okay. If some values comes below 200, then you can say bounded. Okay, below. What what? I understand. If I'm putting m is equal to 100 as a boundary one, huh. so if you, any series if you given and you are able to find the answer and you got it below to the hundred, huh. so you can say you can say that bounded below. Okay, fine, fine. And if it come more than the bounded area, that will come in the next topic. So okay, fine. Topic. Okay, so okay. which one theoretical part they have done? We'll also do it. We'll go to the question uh, which they are doing in the college. Same questions I will do it also. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so P series first. Hmm. So here P series, the statement is there, and that a statement all you have to keep in mind so you can decide here and hmm. which to apply here. The statement is given here if series in form. So they won't ask the proof for exam, right? Proof also it will come sometime. Okay. Okay. Proof also it will come. Hmm. But in the it will come not like a, it not like come a, like they prove the P series like that not. It will, okay. they will give the question only. Hmm. Like I will tell you here. Yeah. Series okay. of, series in the form of if we hmm. like this. One by one to the power of P plus one by two to the power of P plus hmm. one. P to the power of p and so on is given here. Huh. One by n power of p. This one. Hmm. So this one I can write it here. Some that's summation of one by n to the power of p format, right? Yeah. So if any series is given in the form of one by n to the power p, this is the format. Okay. Is p series. Hmm. And we can say that this summation of one by n to the power p, okay, is equal to Convergent when its p is greater than one. Okay. And divergent when p is less than or equal to. If p is less than or equal to one. Huh. Getting it? So this yeah. is the p series. So questions it will not come to prove that p series like this. Okay. okay. Questions only will uh, they will give like that here. Yeah? Okay. Huh. And, and the answer proof also should be there. Hmm. Question now see okay. one by n power of I uh, have two is there. Huh. Okay, so I can say that uh, two is greater than one. Huh. So this is converging it, right? Yeah. But if you given one by n to the power of x, hmm. so x you don't know, right? Yeah. So that type question can come here. So x okay. you don't know. So that time you have to okay, have to take the condition case one, case two, when hmm. what will happen? And means mainly you have to do the proof this one. 
So how do you know that uh, which proof you have to use which? Uh, uh, that that also I'll tell you. Which okay. any question also if it comes they will not mention here. You do by the P test okay. or any test. Okay. So yes. we have. To, I will tell you the trick how to do it. Okay. Okay. So okay. P test is simple here. If anything is given like a small there, n power of five by two is given. So okay. five by two is greater than one. So I can say that is converting. If okay. If n to the, the first power term half. Term you have to check. Hmm. Sorry. The first term power you have to check. Hmm. First not nth power. Nth power. Nth power. Okay. Okay. Hmm. I'll take the example for each. Okay. Like here, consider is given questions here. Hmm. One plus one by four, plus one by nine, plus one by sixteen. Like that one is given. Ah. Hmm. So here we don't know n term. We have to find the n term. Yeah. So here I can write it here. This one as fine. This mm. four is two. I can write here two a square, right? This one is three yeah. a square. I can write it one yeah. by square. I can write it. And mm. here if you not given one square is anyways one only. Yeah. So summation of a of n I can write it here. The n term will be what one by n square. Yeah. Because a plus n minus one mm. you can do it because. Yeah. Hmm. So here. And n term when you find it here, put it also and check out it's correct or not. Okay, okay. It four here, so it should get it here. One by four square, you are getting four term. Yeah. Third term similarly, second term you can check out by putting in the n term because if n term is wrong, everything mm. will. Be. So mm. always when you find the n term by using the AP or GP, mm. you try to check out this like a randomly you put it n is equal to three or two and check okay. out our, our n term is correct or not. Okay. So we got it here, one mm. by. That summation of one by n square, right? Hmm. That n is one by n square. Hmm. Now n is what here? That n power is two. Two. P is two here. Okay. So that's in format n power p. Hmm. That's why here I use the format here. Okay. Okay. So this is this is the, that's why here this is the series uh -huh. if given in the format here. So when the format is p test, then only you can check out this one. Uh huh. Okay, all the question you cannot do by the PC, uh, P test only. Okay. But if format is given like this one by n square, so you can check out that it's like a same as a P test, uh, P series only, right? Mm -hmm. So P series having when P is greater than one, then is converting. Yeah. So P is equal to two means greater than one is there. This is converting here. So we mm -hmm. can say this summation of a n as which series is given is ah. actually converting. Okay. Okay, and we have to write yeah. also by which method. So we can write here this summation this a of n. Mm -hmm. Converging, they are convergent by p test. Getting? Okay. Yeah. Now we'll do two three tests. Then I will tell you the problems. I will do the problems and I will tell you how to analyze which method you have to use it. Okay. Second is comparison test. Mm. Okay. So here yeah, randomly. Means they have done so many questions in the P test, then it's come to the another test. Okay, so I will I will also do the same what they are doing in the college. Okay, hmm. so all the problem also I will do the same call which one they are doing in the college. But just uh, let me finish that concept here so directly I will go to the questions. And you have more students from my college, sir. Hmm. Sorry. You have more students from my college. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Okay. Huh. So you know the what that written in the already uh, that test, the Lambert test and all. Yeah. All the information I have, so no worries. Okay. That's very good. So comparison test here, you let consider here hmm. that a of n they will give you, right? Summation of a of n. This one you have to want to check out. Yeah. A n and b of n. The summation of b n is two positive term series. Hmm. Says that limit of n tends to infinity. That so can we use the variables uh, u n and v n? <laughs> That's what we use in school, so it'd be easier. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Summation of u n hmm. and summation of v of n. Okay, hmm. are two positive series. Such that limit of n tends to infinity. 
that u n by v n. Hmm. We have to find the limit u n by v n. Hmm. And tends to infinity. Okay. okay. If hmm. you got some constant l. Okay. Hmm. Constant means it should not get zero. Hmm. Okay. None, none zero and finite. It should not get zero. It should not get infinity. Hmm. Then only it will this test it will work. If you got it zero, then this is given and we have to find v n, no? Ah, uh, yeah. I will tell you. I will tell you. Okay. Ah, okay. Then. Okay, so u n v n. I don't know now v n what is v n, but ah. if given two series u n v n, hmm. you have to tell test to infinity and check out the l. Okay. Getting hmm. l should come zero should not come infinity. Hmm. So it will depend upon the now because we have to find u n. Yeah. So u n is the question which is given v n we have to assume here actually. Oh. Tell you how hmm. to assume it also. Hmm. V n we have assumed just you are doing the comparison by. Hmm. That's why the name is comparison test. Yeah. Okay. So if u n by v n if you limit you got it l, uh, that constant some l huh. which is not zero is not infinity huh. then depend upon the v n u n yeah. will also decide okay huh. so huh. if summation of v of n hmm. is convergent okay huh. then, then u n also will be convergent u n also is convergent only okay and if if summation of v of n is Divergent, then summation of v of n is divergent. also divergent. Get it here? So okay. based on the un, uh, un actually the question is given. V n we are assuming here. Hmm. We'll assume v n. Okay. And we will find the limit. It should hmm. not come zero and should not come infinity. Hmm. And depend upon the v n now we can hmm. decide the un whether it is converging or divergent. Okay. Getting here? Hmm. Now see here more questions I'll do here. Like consider is given here questions. Huh. One of one. Yeah. One plus one by root two. Plus one by root three. Huh. Plus one by root four. And so on. We have to discuss the nature of the series. Okay. So uh, one by one means I can write here one by one here also root one. Hmm. Root one is what same only, right? Yeah. So what will be a n? Tell me. One by root n. Root n only because that a p is there, right? One two three four and so on going on. One two three. So if a plus n minus one into d if you apply here, you'll uh -huh. get it. A n, right? Root n. Uh -huh. So now here you can write here one by root n means n to the power of half, right? Yeah. So this one you can do it by p test only because we know that one by n power p. Yeah. It's and just n. Yeah. Half is which is that is. Yes, I want. Yes, I want. So okay. it's divergent. So we can this one is simply you can do by the p okay. test. Now yeah. I will do some questions based on the comparison test. Hmm. See, other is this also hmm. question is there in your text notebook. One into two into three is given. Yeah. Plus one by that's one into two. They have taken. I taken a three also. Yeah. Uh -huh. In the we have seen in the college, they taken hmm. one by one into two, right? We are taking three also, no problem. Hmm. Two into three into four plus one by three into four into five. Huh. And so. Okay. So here you tell me the end term. What you can write? Uh. One of one. This is for the n because one, two, three, and so on. It's going n. Okay. For this Should one, we two, multiply those terms or just keep no, it like? No. Multiply for then we will not. Uh, we can't determine what what is going on. Okay. See here, how to check the n term here. Huh. See here, next term what you can write by deciding only you can check out here. One first yeah. term is two, three. This huh. is two, three, four, three, four, five. So here we we'll get yeah. it four, five, six. Four, five, six. Here six, seven, eight. Yeah. So on. So means here which n because hmm. which term is there? That only it's coming, right? Hmm. This is the first term, so one came. This is second term. That's why starting with two we came. Yeah. This third term, so starting with three came. Ah. Huh. One by four came because four term huh. is so n term will be n. Okay. And here this huh. is extra n plus one. 
Oh, and n plus two. N plus two. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, if you don't know this one, this one, this one is not method. This one is just uh, the method is what here. You can check okay. out what it's going in. One, two, three. Mm. First time. One, mm. two, three, four. It's going on, right? Huh. So I will apply. This is in the AP only, right? Yeah. So a plus n minus one into d I will use it. So one oh. plus n minus one into one, which is uh -huh. one plus n minus one. So okay. n. The first time will be n. Hmm. Similarly here, two, three, four is going. Hmm. Two, three, four. Huh. So a, uh, that a plus n a minus one into huh. b. So two plus n minus one. Okay. Hmm. Two plus n minus one. Sorry. So this is n plus one. Okay. This is n plus one as well. So we can always find the the nth term using these uh, methods. Yeah. AP, that's, okay. yeah. That's why I call the AP and GP formula. You have okay. to find the nth terms. Sometimes the questions only they will give nth term, but sometimes huh. they will give in the series. So you have to find the nth terms. Okay. And after the finding the nth terms, okay, mm -hmm. check out also. I told you so many times. Okay, because if this is wrong, then everything will be no. Mm -hmm. What you are doing is all the time waste only. Okay. So you can check out whether it's connected. Kind of, put it here. This is the fourth term, right? First, second, third, and fourth term. This is. Yeah. If n is equal to four, if you put it in this, it should yeah. get its values. Okay. So put it four here. So one by four, five, six, mm. getting it here. Mm. Right? Understood? Yeah. No. Hmm. So our <coughs> term is correct. Huh. Any doubt till here? No. Hmm. So now here n term is got it here. So he, here only a of n is equal to we don't know which method to use it, either p-test or comparison test. Yes, several tests also which you have not studied till, but we don't know which method to do it. Uh -huh. so what I will do it here, we have to find the limit mainly. Mm -hmm. So then, and that it's convergent and divergent is depend upon the n value, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, discussing the first yeah. thing. When yeah. this n is what if you tend to infinity, then it's divergent. Mm -hmm. When you put it infinity and the result is also infinity, then divergent. Uh -huh. If there's some constant value, then it's convergent. Hmm. So here we will try to find out here max that all the n outside. Uh -huh. Take the all n out common here outside. Uh -huh. This is already n is there here. If yeah. you take here n1 outside, then become n square and yeah. this is n q. So I can write it here 1 plus 1 upon n. This one I can write 1 plus 2 upon n. 2 upon n, yeah. Getting here? Yeah. <clears throat> now see, okay, this one you cannot do the p test. Why? Yeah. Because p test only one by n q is there, then we can do it. Yeah. This is several uh, another thing is there, right? P test means only one by n q the one by n p format should be there, not sum of anything, <coughs> right? Yeah. So we cannot do the p test. Hmm. So comparison test we can do it. What is comparison test here? Hmm. That let's consider your college u n only that again. Even this one, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. So u n is this. Yeah. We can have to assume, yeah. assume here hmm. by checking it here how much maximum power of Means oh this yeah, one. n bar p q that one. Yeah. Okay. This one I have to use as a because this is disturbing here. Huh. If you limit n to infinity, if you put it here also, you can put it and check out. Yeah. Mm. But n cube is there, you cannot put infinity here. Okay. Oh. Because it one by n. Okay. Limit of n tends to infinity is given. So it was one by n. We could test for infinity. You could yeah, put because one by infinity that is zero. It will give. So this power we can't put the infinity substitute. Mm, yeah, one by n square is given. Yeah, n cube is given. Power two is given. You cannot do it. Okay. Okay. Why? Because it will follow the indeterminate form. Because hmm. maybe infinite infinity is what reciprocal values. Okay. Yeah. Come to the numerator. Huh. Okay. Huh. So we cannot predict that time values here. Yeah, maybe negative values. It's a square become positive. Hmm. It's not necessary always will go to the zero, but here yeah. if you put it in like one by one, one, mm. one by thousand, very small values, one by one crore, all very, very small values, so it's tending mm. zero only, right? Mm. Yeah. And get zero. But here NQ is there, we cannot do. Yeah. So our target is there to remove this one. Mm. So to, to remove this one here, mm. we are choosing it B of N is equal yeah. to one upon N of Q. Okay. Why one upon I am taking here? Because we have to take un by vn. Huh. So un by vn, if you do the vn, it will come numerator, right? Nq is yeah. un is this. Yeah. 1 plus 1 by n, and this is 1 plus 2 by n. Right? So, one second, wasn't um, uh, 1 by uh, n power, uh, highest power of the denominator by uh, a minus 
highest power of numerator, right? Mm, sorry. Uh, so he taught us uh, one by for finding V n one oh. by n power p minus q, where p is the highest power of denominator and q is the highest power of numerator. Hmm, that numerator is nothing, is there? No. Power of uh, isn't it like supposed to be power of one? One power one. No. 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 Okay. Let's see. Let's see. I will tell you about here. You can see a numerator if you given also. Yeah. Huh. Numerator if you given also. Huh. That will get cancelled here because consider if numerator is given n here. Huh. So here you can cancel it, right? When n n n s n q will be oh. n square. Yeah. 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 So you have not take a numerator and denominator. Here you check out here you have taken outside, right? Huh. You have taken outside. You yeah. check out what is the maximum power is outside here. Huh. That one by n q, right? So what about the existing one? We are not going to take one power one. We are going to keep it as zero, right? One power zero. Hmm. 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 Oh, okay. Fine. Hmm. Here one power. Got it. Then nothing to think about here. Just to check out the power here, maximum power here. Okay. Huh. Or this, uh, don't make it complicated. Check out because you see here why you are doing here. Why you make, uh, remember the method and all. Leave huh. it. What you are doing it should be transparent here. So yeah. here, what you are doing here, we are because we cannot put limit n tends to infinity when a square and cube is given. Huh. So we want to remove this. Hmm. That's why. So okay. you want to remove this one. So then what you will do? Divide the same number. Then only it will remove. Yeah. yeah. Logical, right? Yeah. So, <coughs> so whatever the number, like one by three, is there. I want to remove this one and make it one. So I could divide one that's by two. Exactly. Yeah. Right? So yeah. that's the thing we are doing. Here. So V n is equal to actually whatever the value is given in the outside, we divide mm -hmm. with the values. Huh. So here limit of n uh, now u n by V n if you are doing here u n is one by this one. Hmm. V n becomes what one by n power three. N power three. So it will go up here, right? Yeah. So limit of n tends to n infinity. Three, it's cancel. Hmm. U n by V n I can write it here. Huh. One up one. N one plus one by n, one plus two by n, right? N to mm. the power of three. This one, this one cancel. Mm. So now we have no any restrictions here to n power of anything is there. Okay. So now I can limit of n tends to infinity. I can put it in this. Huh. Getting? Yeah. So you put it here. So one yeah. upon as it is here. One plus this one by infinity is zero. Yeah. Plus one plus two by infinity also is zero. Mm. You will get here one because this one. Huh. One plus zero is one. One plus zero is one. One into one is one. Hmm. So we got it here one. Yes. Yeah, so one we got it here. We not get zero. We not get infinity. Okay. Mm. I have to show that you should not get zero. You should not get infinity. Hmm. And we have not got also because we got the work constant value one. Yeah. So our present test is successful. But now if we depend upon the BN. Uh, depend upon the Vn, you can decide whether it's convergent or divergent. Uh -huh. So Vn is equal to we have solution here one by n to the power three. Hmm. So to find the limit for Vn. Hmm. Sorry. To find the limit of uh, Vn. No, no, no. P test you can check out. No. Oh, correct. Okay. Yeah. The P test we can say that P is equal to three. Uh -huh. P is three, so it's greater than one. So it's one. It's convergent. It's convergent, right? Yeah. So right here, V of n is We have to write this uh, statement here. Converging hmm. by p test. Hmm. So u n also hmm. is convergent. Okay. By comparison. Oh yeah, yeah, correct. Yeah. Okay, so okay. this is by the p test. This is by the this this thing we have to write it in the yeah. Uh, ah. Any doubt in this? No, sir. So this is how we have to. Do it here. Vn always keep in mind here. Whatever the power is given, that we will take as an outset. Huh. I'll do one more problem, then you'll understand. Yes. Yeah. <coughs> given root two minus one of one. This okay. is also they have done in the college. Three power three minus one. Hmm. So I'm given. Tell me the uh, first of that n stuff. Mm. See here, here you can write two, three, and four. It's going on here means 
minus this one is one is there one one always one so last term also will be one only right hmm. divided by this is three four five it's going here so here n plus two to the n power of three. cube yeah minus, minus one hmm. wow that okay. is the n terms okay so also you can do by the same ap which i said two three four it's going on in the numerator that part and here three four five it's going on Hmm. A plus means three plus n minus one into hmm. one. So three plus n minus one, which is n plus two, right? Hmm. Hmm. Any doubt till here? No, sir. If you want, have a confusion in the n term, you check out. Ah, you can so, take n outside now, right? No, no. First, we will check out whether n term is correct or not. I told her always keep in ah. habit. Ah. Because this one is wrong, everything will be wrong. Yeah. So put it two here and check out. This is this should become here. N is equal to two plus one, three. Four cube, yeah, four cube. Two plus two, four cube minus one. You're getting it, right? Yeah, getting it. So our n term is correct. Hmm. Uh, now we have no clue here which method to do it because I have several methods. We have done two only, but several method to do it. Okay. Uh, so comparison only, right? Sorry. Comparison method we have to do. Hmm. Okay, because we cannot do the p test. Yeah, we can't. Yes. Another hmm. method we have not learned only. Yeah. So, so here, uh, what you can take outside here? I told her what is the method. And yeah, yeah, any method if you given, any test if you given. First, you have to take common here to decide yeah. what is going on. Okay. Yeah. So here, the numerator if you take the maximum power is outside. Maximum power is what here? Root n. Root n. So n power half. Root of n if you take outside here. So what will you get in the bracket? Uh. So get it one plus one by n. Yeah. Minus one by root n. So uh, one plus one by n. Uh, n uh, root of root of n was taken out, right? Okay. Wait, one plus the root. Okay, okay, okay. It's not getting out of once. Uh, step by step. No, just with with the roots, I get confused uh, inside. Or oh, the one. No, no, no. Step by step there. Ah. Out of this one. Step by step, it will do. Okay. Huh. This one first you take here. Yeah. This one in in the bracket only you take. Ah. N. Ah. So here what will you get? One plus one by n will get it. Yeah. This one I have done nothing. I have done here. in the bracket only. I did this in this. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Go ahead. Huh. This one is as it is only. Yeah. Here also if you take n power three outside here, so I can write here one plus two by. Two by uh, n. N power three don't write. N will write it. One okay. plus two by n. Mm. That whole two or q I can write it. Mm. Minus one. Now no confusion because yeah. I have everything I have done in the bracket. Ah. Yeah. So now if you take this one in outside here, so it's just like a like root of a in v is mm. root into root v, right? Hmm. Yeah. V in them. Yeah, yeah. So I can write okay. it. Here. Okay. Got it. Yeah. Of n into root of Hmm. One plus one by n. I can write it. Hmm. Minus one. Yeah. Five, what I can write? N power three. And here I can write one plus two by n to the power of three. Hmm. Minus one because a b q also meaning is that a q b q. Yeah. Right. Ah. Any doubt till here? No, no sir. So now root n you take the outside from the both because yeah. this is root n <coughs> only in this. Hmm. The root n means actually dividing it. Yeah. So here we'll get it. What? Uh, that square root of one plus one by n. Yeah. Minus one by root n. Because here it is not there. No, in root n. So we'll divide it. Why? So why last uh, minus one by root n? We'll do it. I consider if we give it here. Huh? Minus one. Yeah. If we two, if we taking out, then what will we get? One uh, minus one by two. One, one, one by two. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. Because Two dividing means two taking out means two dividing it. Yeah. So here root n I am taking here means root n dividing it in the both term. In uh, one second. So but then n was not in under the root, no? So n uh, sorry one one was not under the root, no? One was separate. So do uh, we have so to divide that? Whatever, so here whatever the term you are taking it here, you have to divide it. Two okay. minus one is there. If you want to take three common. Huh. So what I will write? N is already out, root n is already outside. No, why are we taking? No, 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 no outside. This is only made with this. 
1 by square root of 2 plus 1 by square root of 3. All they have questions have done in the same in the college also. Okay. Okay. All this is last year question paper only. So this one here. So n term tell me. It will be 1 by root over n plus root over n plus 1. So un is this here, so I can, how, uh, what are the numerator, nothing is there, okay? Yeah. So here what you can take outside? Uh, n. n if, uh, then means in the inside, right? Root of n is actually. Oh. Huh. Yeah, yeah, correct, correct. So here 1, and here we will get it here. That inside just like uh, n plus, plus 1 plus by uh, n, right? Yeah. So root over 1 plus 1 by n. Any doubt in this? No, sir. If you having doubt, then you can do the step by step like as we did in the. No, I understood this. Because n you take an outside here, so 1 plus 1 by n it will come here. If you take outside here, so root n will be there. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Like this. Right? Yeah. So 1 by now root n plus, plus. this a into b. So root a into root of 1 plus 1 by n I can write it. Right? Yeah. Like root a b i take an example root a into root b. Yeah. Like same here. Now you can take root of n outside here. So we'll get it the same thing. One plus one by n. One yeah, root of. Yeah. Okay. Huh. Now here, this is un. So here we cannot decide because n is given here, right? Hmm. So b of n have to choose here. Again is what here? One by root n I will choose on this because this one I want to cancel it. Yeah, yeah. So limit of n tends to infinity, un yep. by vn is 1 upon root over n into 1 plus root over of 1 plus 1 by n. Mm. V of n, it will go in the reciprocal 1 by n, so it will become root of n here. Mm. Right? Yeah. So limit of n tends to infinity here. If we put it here infinity, so we'll get it this one as a 1 by 0. And uh, yeah. 1 by infinity is 0, 0 plus 1 is 1. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Root over this will get it one by two. Uh, it will be one plus root one, no? Hmm. So one plus root over one. So root over one is also one only, no? Yeah. So one plus one is called to what? One by two. One by. So it's not zero. It's not infinity. Ah, so because you see, it's not coming always one only, no? Yeah. Like these two questions we have done, it is getting the one always. Okay. Yeah. Here maybe some values different here, so that's why here you check out in the information. Maybe come zero also sometimes. Okay. Mm. So here not zero, not infinity. Yeah. So, so we have to check Correct. V of n you have to yeah. check out. V of n is n power of one by two. Mm. Half yeah, yeah. One by one. N power half. And so half is less than one. Less than one. So V of n is but actually divergent. Yeah by p test hmm. so u of n is also divergent watch this test watch this root test okay hello yes hmm. so let's watch this root test means consider if we given summation of a of n is any sum of series. Getting here? Yeah. Positive terms, series is given. So if a of n to the power of 1 by n, if you take 1 by to the power of 1 by 10, take uh, 1 by n, we have to take by all. Okay. And limit of n tends to infinity if you apply it here. And you got it constant, consider L. Okay. Then this summation of A n is sorry, A of n is convergent convergent will be there if L is less than 1 and divergent if L is greater than 1. And if L is equal to 1, then test L. Use the term comparison test. 
getting yeah so got it so this is the so see here you which which type of question we have to do by the positive test like something is given power okay like here something is given like consider example here if something uh, like a, a numerator power is given numerical power so yes sir hmm, like here consider if you given like consider 2 to the power of n given here okay so what you can do it here this is an is given here so we can take one by n by on and we can cancel this n okay you whatever is given even if power is there on top of that you should be one by n hmm so if something power if any questions it given something with power so that time you can use the cauchy's rule test okay okay i'll take the example then understood okay <laughs> last one also i will finish it another two test is there it found so just take this one another is dl number test dl number ratio test so let the summation of n be the positive terms so you have to find it here next terms n plus 1 term okay 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 so you apply first so i can so limit of n tends to infinity next term means like a of n is given n replaced with n plus 1 okay so can you repeat your voice is not coming coming loudly hello hello sir oh, 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 yeah sir can you repeat the last part that is uh, so summation of an is given any positive terms here uh -huh. so we have to put n in n replaced with n plus 1 it will become next term okay like consider n square is the last term right so n square plus 1 so n plus 1 which means here n replaced with n plus 1 that means n plus 1 square okay yeah hmm. Understood. Write it down. Oh, so next time you find it here, and take the n plus one by a of n. Okay. That should come any constant l here. Okay. Understood this one here? Yes. Sir. And here, if l you got it here, summation of a n is convergent if l is less than one. divergent if l is greater than 1 and l is equal to 1 then test fail okay and you have to use comparison test getting here yeah so see here okay, i have written this, this one see here okay, you can no need to remember here comparison test method only remember but this one is the same only okay this we have to keep in mind because after that only you can decide whether the convergent and divergent no to find the value but you have wrong, written the wrong here so do not get the mark yeah inverse and uh, cauchy's test and also comparison test hmm so see here that same but in your college they written here that whatever i am writing here un i r v n they written like a reciprocal oh hmm they written like this one here an by an plus 1 So no problem here. If you take this one, this one will change. Oh. So you don't worry this one. You don't don't remember that. You remember this one only because by using this one here we have not uh, have not uh, keep in mind for this one. You know because it's coming same only. Okay. If you take the reciprocal, this one will be interchange. So you will. Given here x square divided by. Two log of two. Okay. Hello. Yes, sir. Got it. So x to the power of three, three log of three. X power four, four log of four, and plus so on is there. So first you tell me the given terms. And. Uh... N no x bar n plus one 
pi um, uh, n plus 1 log n plus 1. Okay, because if yeah. you put it here, there's 3 here, so 3 plus 1 is 4, and 3 plus 1 4, log of 4. Okay, correct. Getting here? Yeah. So now we have to see here, okay, first of all, we log of here you cannot take n outside, okay? Mm -hmm. If you yeah. take it outside also, log of n plus 1 is given here. If you take it yeah. outside also, you could take here only outside, right? N by 2, 1 by 2. You cannot write here, n is outside means here, you cannot write. Yeah. This is mathematics will not work because this is operator. This operator means this is the base and index is given, okay? You yeah. cannot take over all outside here. So mainly is what we cannot take over all n outside. Okay, so mm. that is comparison test is what here little tricky to think about. Mm. So and p test you cannot do it only. Mm. So another way is there here. Let's try here uh, that Cauchy's is there. Okay. Huh. Cauchy's test is there. Okay, so uh, Cauchy's test is what is a statement is there? If a n given or one by n. Yeah. If I will take this one as a one power n again here, it make I am making it complicated only because here this n nothing. Yeah, will yeah to anyone right mm -hmm. so this is also is what no use getting my point right yeah if something is like here x to the power of n plus one is only is there then i can write it here sir okay. yeah one by n you take it here and mm -hmm. you do whatever the simplification is there but this denominator also is there very long and if i will take one by n it's become a more complicated mm -hmm. so that is also fail, fail. so we yeah. have a method which is that dl number test yeah number Real number test telling here is just to re replace with n plus 1. Yeah. So that one you can do it mostly because x power n plus 1 is given and another f will divide with x power n, n plus 2. So I can cancel it something, right? Yeah. Like x square. So I can cancel this one, I can cancel. So it will be helpful for us to reduce the, this series. Mm. Yeah. That's why we are able to identify mm. in, here in this question, the real number test will be the good. So wherever n is there, you put as put it as n plus one. Mm. Yeah, something is what repeated is given something. Mm. Repeated means like n factorial is given. Okay, mm. n mm. factorial is there, and then and next you replace with n plus one, so become n plus one factorial. So we can write something is what n plus one into n factorial, and you can cancel mm. it this one. So you can reduce it, this type of functions, mm. which okay. is recursive function is there that recursive uh, function a recursive series which is given here. We can mm. use. Huh. Okay. Which is exponential is given that we can use it Cauchy's exponential okay. like two power x yeah x to the power of n plus one something. So power n will get cancelled. So that way you can do it Cauchy's. Okay. And normal algebraic is given that we we know that the comparison test we have done so many questions. Yeah. <coughs> so let's let's try here. So when run the necessary always it will work only. Let's try here. We'll get the idea when we'll do some more for our problems. Okay, so here u of n plus one, I will do it. Then what I will get? X power of n plus two. Or n plus two. N, yeah, yeah, yeah. Log of n plus two, right? Huh. So now I will divide it. That u n by u n plus one by v of n. Hmm. Which one want to remember? That which one, which one, which one? I have taught yeah in the college only. This one, sir. Which you taught. Hmm. So u of n plus 1 by v n of i have got, okay? Huh. So n tends to infinity you do it. So <coughs> that u of n only because there is no any v here. u hmm. of n plus 1 and u n. u of n plus 1 is this one. Huh. x plus 2 by n plus 2. n plus 2 log n plus 2. Log of n plus 2. Into, if you take as a, it will come reciprocal, right? Hmm. So u of n is this one. So this will come here. X to the power of n plus 1. And here we will get it here. That n plus, n plus, one, plus one, 1. And log of n plus 1. Hmm. Yeah, if you want to know anyone, you can divide it here. Not necessary here. Because in the college, yeah, my is not different here. Okay, the same only. Okay, any okay. Can, later you can think about. Okay, later after that simplification. Hmm. Because anyways, I am dividing with a by b. Yeah, b by huh. a. If I, here I'm getting 1 by 2 answer, so here we will get it 2 by uh, 2 only, right? Yeah. So that will not make any difference, okay? So, uh -huh. I don't have to confuse about that. Okay. <coughs> so now, you tell me what other things you can cancel it here. Uh, this one I can cancel with x, right? 
एक्स पार एन इज देर ना दिस सॉरी वन मिनट दिस इज एक्स टू द पावर ऑफ व्हाट रेट एक्स टू द पावर ऑफ एन प्लस टू नो या सो एक्स पार एन प्लस टू आई कैन राइट इट एक्स पार एन इनटू एक्स स्क्वायर ओके लाइक ए पार एम इनटू एन या 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 and here i can write x power n into x yeah so this one this one cancel and this one if i consider x will be there right okay yeah but x will remain on top correct yeah, yeah. x will remain on the top hmm. and this n plus 1 n plus 2 i cannot cancel it here so i will hmm. write it is only okay with x okay yeah What about log uh, n plus one? Only I'm part I'm doing here. Log of numerator is n plus one. Yeah. And here is what n plus one. Log uh, a by b is log a minus b, right? N plus one plus one. I can write it. Ha. Huh. Getting here this hmm. one. Yeah, yeah. So here log a plus b. Hmm. Okay, no, no. Log of a into b is given. Then you write log of a plus log of b. Hmm. Here. Yeah. yeah. This one you write as it is only. Okay. As it is. Okay. So here actually is what n plus one into x by yeah. n plus two into x. Uh, sorry, in this one. Huh? Log of here you can take norm n here, so we'll get it one plus one by n. Yeah. And here it will take here log of n uh, plus get it n into one plus two by right? Ah. So log of a into log of b now we got it. Log of a b is called to log of a plus log of b right? Oh okay. Ah. Hmm. So n plus one x n plus two x. Hmm. Uh, x not there. So log of a, which is log of n, log of b, hmm. log one plus one by n. Okay. Ah. And uh, denominator, what to write? Log of n plus log of one plus two by n. Hmm. So write right here log of that n log of one plus two by Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. So now in this hmm. one, you can write it here. That n plus one into x. Hmm. Yeah, I will write together this one. Here. N plus one divided by n plus two. Hmm. That whole things with the x. This hmm. one log of n is as it is. Huh. And this is the series is there. Yeah. Okay, log of x formula. Log log of x series is there. One plus one by n. Okay, like that. The series formula is there. Okay. So here, <coughs> I will write better here. Hmm. Log of that. One plus x hmm. is equal to that x minus x square by two plus x cube by three, and oh. so yeah. Also, we can write it here. Like summation of n is equal to one to infinity minus one to the power of n minus one one by n x power of n. Okay, this one if you don't want to write, this one keep in mind. This is the series formula. Is there? We will start with this also in the next series. Okay. Yeah, I don't remember correctly. Taylor series and Euclidean series also is there in the. Hmm. Okay, so in the next topic will be there. I mean, last topic in the hmm. series. Hmm. So here we can use it that same formula by hmm. using. We can write here log of one plus x. Yeah. X is what actually here? That is. One by n. n. Right. Yeah. Hmm. So I can write here one by n. Yeah. One by n minus one by n square. Hmm. Right. So one by n 
plus that uh, 1 by 1 by n minus minus 1 by n, n square whole by square by 2 n uh. plus 1 by 3 n cube right hmm n minus n so on hmm and the denominator what to be right like 2 by n yeah minus that 4 by yeah. 4 by n square by 2 yeah yeah so 2 by n square actually hmm right yeah plus this one whole cube so 2 3 8 8 8 by, by n cube by 3 8 by n cube 3 n cube Okay. So this one is what n plus 1 and n plus 2 times x here. Here you can take log of n common in the whole. So, so it should only show first three terms, right? For the series part, log series. Oh, sorry? For the log series that we've written, mm -hmm. it's enough to show the first three uh, ah, first terms. Three terms. Huh. I have not do all. Hmm. So here log of n you can take outside here. Huh. So here if log of it n take if outside here, so we'll get it one here one plus n into log of n. Right? Oh yeah. God. Minus uh, one by log of two n square. One by two n square log of n plus one by three hmm. n cube log of n and so on. Hmm. Divided by this one is also you take log of n. Mm -hmm. So 1 plus 2 by n log of n minus 2 by n square log of n mm -hmm. okay, and so on. Yeah. Plus 8 by 3 n cube that log of n. Mm -hmm. and so on. This one, this one is get cancelled. Yeah. Now if oh. you apply this limit of n tends to infinity. Huh. So this this part is what gone here. Oh, what is in two in infinity square? Hmm. I, I will do it. Limit of n tends to infinity. Huh. This is the, okay. This is I keep as it is only this one. You take n outside n one plus one by n, right? Huh. So here come one plus n one n. plus two by n. Hmm. Two by. Right? Hmm. Yeah. 2 by n, okay? Huh. And this is the whole thing as it is only. Huh. So you put it, infinity put it here, mm. so it's become 1 plus 0. 0. 1, one plus, plus 0. 0. Right? Yeah. And here what will you get? 1 plus this whole term is 0 only. Oh, okay. And down also 1 plus 0. So you got it here 1. Yeah. This x is there, that's why here 1 into huh. x, which is x only. Huh. Getting here? And it yeah. No. So you can write it here now. X means what? You got the some constant values here. Hmm. We are DL numbers. We are doing it here, right? DL numbers. Yeah. yeah. DL numbers, uh, statement is there here. If x that value should come L. Yeah. If L is one, then test fails. So does it, is this failed? Hmm. Hmm. No, no, no. I'll tell you. I'll do it. Huh. We no, didn't get no here. We didn't get one. Okay. We took we took x. Okay. X. No. So here x we don't know. Huh. Consider why we got so one second, sir. How do we why, why do we take it as x? We because got one because question was here x. Hmm. There was x only, you know, it's not numeric value was there, right? Okay, right. Square, okay. X square was not there. Okay, fine, fine. So here we got it. See, here many what the question they want to show that here. Hmm. This is one, this whole hmm. thing. And here x was there, here x is we cannot put anything yeah. because 10 tends to infinity. Hmm. So we finally is what x here. Huh. So DL number the statement is that if x is less than 1, then it's what? Convergent. Hmm. And if x is what? Greater than 1, then yeah, it's divergent. So this one also I will write the same thing only because we don't know the yeah. value of x. Yeah. We don't know the value of x, so I will write also same thing only. Huh. If x less than 1, then convergent. If x is greater than, divergent. Huh. And if x is equal to 1, test fail. Hmm. 
Test fail means what will happen? To try another test. Oh, no, another test. Okay, another test. Another test is what? Only x is there. Huh. Okay, means only that x is there here, right? And x we are assuming as a what? One only. Huh. Limit of n tends to infinity and that is one. Hmm. So you cannot put anything, you'll get it one only. Yeah. So one is what? Convergent only? Because yeah. one is first and value set. Huh. So you can write here, this is finally. Oh, okay. Final. Hmm. This is termed by the DL number test. Hmm. Now finally we can write here, if x is less than and equal to one, then it's convergent. Hmm. If x is greater than one, then is what? Type. Okay. And that equal to equal things equal to things I have not done by the D test. Hmm. D test is failed. But by the comparison test, yeah, I need test to do comparison test means what here? Okay. What so we've simplified it till the end and then we used comparison test in the last step. Mm -hmm, yeah. Okay. Huh. Yeah, if you write also this much is enough. This one also huh. write enough. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Yeah.